Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the new Klondike Cones. This, uh, this is a Cocoa for Caramel and the Vanilla Caramel Classic. This was $7.29 at Meyer, and they don't put any tape on it at all. It's just, it's just an open box. Uh, there you go. But there you go. There's uh -huh. two different, you can tell the difference, Vanilla Caramel and co uh, Coke, uh, is it cuckoo? I think it's called cuckoo for caramel. Cuckoo. I think I said cocoa for caramel. It's, it's hard to read. It's, it's cuckoo. It's cuckoo for caramel. It's hard okay. to read though in the box. Okay. So. so which one are you doing first? The, just the vanilla? The vanilla. So you get eight of those uh, cones, eight of these cones. Frozen dairy dessert. So this is not ice cream. Peanuts fall over there. Peanuts fall over there. Um. Vanilla I mean, Caramel Classic. Va vanilla Frozen Dairy Dessert, Caramel Sauce Core, Chocolatey Coating, and Peanuts Naturally and Artificially Flavored. <laughs> They're both 240 calories. So no, no matter which flavor you choose, 240 calories. Okay. That's all I've got for you. Unilever, Product of Russia. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's wherever. Peanuts escaping everywhere. We need to get to the core. Because all I tasted was basically peanuts. Because that's all that's on the top. Is peanuts. There it is. You know what's interesting is the ice cream really doesn't taste like the traditional uh, Klondike ice cream. Mm -mm. Not that I remember at least. Maybe it's the mixture of the peanuts and the chocolate, but, mm -hmm. but it doesn't taste like that traditional Klondike. Side note, side story. Andrew, our son, sent me a message the other night and he said they had handed Gavin, our grandson, one of these uh, ice creams and he was eating it and he said, I want you to show you how he's eating it. He had bit the tip off the end the uh, because he didn't want the peanuts on the top. <laughs> so that was always my favorite part of any ice cream mm -hmm. was the peanuts. And he's eating it from the bottom because he wants to the avoid bottom. the peanuts, yeah, that's um, which is funny. That core is like, there's not a lot there. It's ah, a, it's a very teeny tiny little dot of stuff. I think you'd have mm. to eat three-fourths of that ice cream cone before you got to it. No. <laughs> Once you get to the core, it's actually really good caramel. Yeah. The caramel has a really sweet, um, it's a traditionally sweet caramel flavor. It's not like a cooked caramel. Uh, very, very nice caramel, but it takes a long time before you get That's there. That's what I'm saying. You're going to have to eat the whole top off before you ever get there. Right. Well, let's try the cook for caramel it is and, and i hope that's the way they intend for you to say it if not it's then c-o-o-c-o-o -O -C -O -O. then i sound like a yeah. fool uh, i would but, think it was spooky as well um caramel frozen dairy dessert so the the first one was vanilla this one the actual ice uh, cream, ice cream the, dessert. the dessert is actually caramel flavor um Caramel sauce core, chocolatey coating, and peanuts, natural and artificial. Of course, it has more peanuts on it. Do you want to take a first bite? No, peanuts? you do it this time. It does seem to have more peanuts. I'm sure that's just a fluke. But you can see a big difference. Now, see, this one looks better because that caramel extended all the way up into this top part. Mm -hmm. That one didn't mm -hmm. at all. Yeah, but I'll tell you what, you taste caramel, I guess because it's the caramel flavored ice cream, you really taste the caramel. Big time. Yeah, the core is right there. Mm -hmm. I'd say that depends on, you know, just the machine it got put in there with. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like the caramel one better. That one, the cuckoo, mm -hmm. I like that one better. Just because it has all caramel. I do too. And that one, you didn't get to the caramel core at all until you got basically level with the cone, even a little bit lower than the cone. Um, you didn't hit the caramel until then. If they, but, 
if we were to get another one and open it up, it might be higher. It may so, be. So we um, can only judge what we get. We, we right, exactly. Um, I this it's okay. It wouldn't be out. It, there's nothing wrong with it. I do like the caramel flavor. I think I would choose the vanilla. Oh, really? Yeah. I think I would choose the vanilla over the caramel. Because I think once they flavored that dessert with it, I think it has um, an artificial caramel flavor. And I it would... It does, but I like it. <laughs> and, and I would rather just have the sweetness from the... I think it shined more in just the vanilla. Right. I think it had a chance to really stand out and just be super, super sweet. Whereas in this one, the caramel one, it just kind of gets lost uh, because all that frozen dairy dessert is caramel. Um, I, I personally would pass on these. Yeah. I just don't think they're that big of a deal. No, I don't either. Um, I like the caramel one, the one you don't like, but um, but then again, I have half a box of ones that are just okay to me. So right, so they're advertising on here. You have the Reese's, you have the cookies and cream, and then you have the chocolate and vanilla. Uh, and these, I think we tried all of them. I think we did review. Yeah, I think we've reviewed every one of them. They're okay. They're okay. Uh, would would I personally, if I went to the store right now, what would I pick? I would go for a drumstick. Yeah, I would too. I would ju I would choose a drumstick over any of these. So um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.